In order to enhance the local seed system for farmers in Nigeria and the West African sub-region, Oxfam in Nigeria is currently in talks with its donor partners to develop strategies aimed at increasing yields to ensure food security in West Africa. This discussion took place during a one-day dialogue with humanitarian actors and stakeholders in Abuja. Now, John Makina, the country representative of Oxfam in Nigeria, stated that the objective of this dialogue is to empower farmers to boost their productivity amid the challenges posed by climate change. So this particular project is basically advocating where, before the introduction of a particular seed crop, we need to do a thorough testing, ensure we have disseminated diverse and adaptable seed varieties uh, that would foster sustainable and resilient agricultural system. This project has already been tested in two states, in Bauchi and Ijigawa states, where the project is currently being implemented and has had uh, farmers accessing five new diverse uh, varieties of milk and uh, sorghum. The success in these particular areas has been uh, through the, as I said, rigorous testing of some different varieties. And in these two uh, states, there were 10 different varieties that were tested in the 20 farmer field schools that were introduced to see how suitable the particular crops that have been advocated for uh, would do in these particular areas. Now, other stakeholders say they are committed to learning new ways to improve on local seedings in Nigeria and the West African sub-region. You know, there are things that are valuable on the farm that can help the farmers is seed because it accounts for 50 percent of the farm investment and if you don't have good seeds it's already 50 percent loss at the beginning and for us to enhance productivity because the lands are being limited they need to have viable seeds that will improve their productivity at the unit area, knowing that as our population is expanding, the lands are not expanding. This is the reason why I always commend the project, because by extension, they are complementing the efforts the government is doing to ensure that these promising materials with good genetics get to the last mile farmer in a sustainable manner. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.